Welcome to the Raptors post-game interview. I'm joined by Enrique Zamora, who gets the win tonight as the Raptors move to 22-10 and and knock off the Green Bay Bullfrogs 11-3. Enrique, thank you for joining me. I appreciate it. So what were you looking for tonight in your game plan? This is a Bullfrog team that you got a chance to look at last night in a, a win for the Raptors. Did you have anything that you pinpointed as something that you wanted to attack? Yep, uh, Cooper did a good job of showing, you know, hitter swings and stuff. But uh, basically my game plan was just to come out, throw strikes, and, uh, you know, the defense behind me, uh, they, could do, they could do the rest for me. They've certainly shown that all season long, and that showed up as well in the stat line through the first four innings or so where you were working on a no-hitter. That went you know, by the wayside with one out in the fifth, but was that something you were thinking about at all? I mean, yeah, of course, whenever you start seeing the zero as the game goes on uh, in the hits column, yeah, you start to think about it. But, yeah, basically the game plan stayed the same. Just wanted to keep throwing strikes and, you know, just uh, keep throwing up goose eggs. Well, you certainly did that. It worked out well. Five scoreless was the final tally. What have you been doing this summer that you think has contributed to your success? You were a guy that kind of was a late addition and a relative unknown around the team, and you've really performed well and put a, uh, your stamp on a starting spot. So what do you think has contributed to that you know, sustained su success? Mm -hmm. I'd say that... Uh at first, it was to come here, uh, get a couple starts, definitely, and get some exposure because I did graduate from my old school. But uh, I'm working with another red shirt year. So basically, uh, I'm out here trying to um, basically prove myself, uh, try to, trying to get attention to me by schools, uh, professionals, scouts, you know, anything. And that's really been the fuel to my success. I'm just, I'm just trying to prove that I can, I can compete. Well, you picked a good night to do it. From my understanding, there were a couple of scouts in the seats tonight. So congratulations and another excellent outing. And last, lastly, before I let you go, what's the team mentality like right now with all these wins piling up? You guys are four games from wrapping up what would be the first playoff berth in franchise history. The magic number is just two. How does it feel to be a part of the clubhouse day in and day out? Man, it's... Most most teams, when you run into this, you know, a lot of them are uptight. You know, they're always worried about we have to win, we have to do that stuff. But honestly, this playing for this team, it's a blast. It's a real good time. You know, we have good atmosphere in the dugout. We're just out here playing the game we love and having fun. And you know, winnings, you know, winnings always a good thing too. But yeah, just the mentality of the team and everything, it's just a good time. We're out here just playing playing baseball. Well, you've certainly made it fun for everyone around the team and the fans. An incredible crowd tonight. More than 1,700 fans that stayed all the way through of what was a blowout win and another Raptors W. So that's all we have for the Raptors postgame tonight. Enrique Zamora gets the W, five scoreless, and a season-high seven strikeouts.